The fact that Coyle noticed what we've been up to makes it too dangerous to continue killing at our usual pace. From now on, we have to be even more careful and make sure that nobody else happens to notice a trend in these deaths. Now, on to the main topic. Who should we kill? <sighs> I think we should focus on ELF insurance. If they expand into the Japanese market, Yotsuba and many other companies will lose valuable clients to them. Agreed. All right, any objections to killing these people from ELF with accidental deaths? No, no objections. objections. <gasps> Is this for real? How can they do this so easily? Another potential candidate is Santoro Zenzai, a member of the Kugisawa group. He's been protesting Yotsuba's resort development plans. Zenzai's known to have high blood pressure, so we can designate a time for him to suffer a stroke resulting in natural death. Any objections? No, no objections. objections. Kira? Deaths by accident? By disease? Designated times of death? It's all just as we suspected. We were right. No, unfortunately. We can only be completely sure after those people they've named are dead. <sighs> we will continue to monitor these meetings and take note of what they say, how they act, and most importantly, whether the people they choose actually die. If we can confirm the connection between their plans and the deaths, then we'll definitely be able to catch Kira. Rizaki! Uh, oh. <clears throat> what is it? There's no need to yell in unison. I can't carry on knowing these people will die. That's just immoral. Right. Here it comes. I know you're planning to catch Kira by letting these guys actually carry out these murders, but we can't let that happen. That's right. It's obvious that these seven men are behind the killings. With Matsuda's testimony and this footage we've recorded, we have all the evidence. You're making this difficult. If we were to take action, 